Raw, one of the most legendary UK grime MCs of all time, JFE. Oh, guys, I've got a text. Just What's good, guys? This challenge, we want to hear the power of your words. We want you to write 32 bars talking about something that's important to you. So good luck, and we'll see you lot soon. Sick. To me, rap is protest music. That's what it came from, that's what it should be, a fucking heart and soul of it. What type of theme? Kind of like racism within the media. Okay. So like how the media portray us and how they get people thinking a certain way of us. What about yours? Self-hatred within the black community. As in like how black people, they have a hate within themselves for themselves. Yeah. And then they spread that to other black people as well. When I had the beat, I knew that I wanted to write about homelessness. Um, I feel like where I come from in Ilford is something that's right on my doorstep. Another big rise in the number of people infected by coronavirus in the UK. Today is performance day and we know how much the challenge means to the artists, but unfortunately the pandemic's got really serious and for everyone's safety, we have to send everybody home and pause the competition. The competition. The UK has recorded its highest number of deaths linked to the coronavirus. It all happened so fast, it was like, cool, we all have to go home, we have to stop. It's frustrating because I know that the rap game is a competition that can change my life. Black Lives Matter! George Floyd's just been killed by the police in America. Bro, like, it's just seeming like mad things are getting worse. It's a lot to take in. It's been a lot to take in. The government need to pull their finger out and sort this out because I genuinely don't know how much more of this I can take, man, honestly. After five months of lockdown, restrictions have eased and it's now safe for us to resume the competition. It's important for us to give the artists the opportunity to finish what they started. Yeah, man. Woo! Well. Sadly though, Shogun is missing out. He's broken the rules of quarantine and now has to isolate by himself for another seven days before it's safe for him to rejoin the penthouse. I can take my punishment, it's fine. Facts. And when it's okay for me to come back, I'll come back strong and it broke. 100% my bro, I'll be looking forward to it. Good to see you, little boy. What's going on? We brought one of the most legendary UK grime MCs of all time. Please can we give it up? JME. <laughs> I was just gassed because Jamie's an artist that yeah. I've listened to from a little boy. So it was amazing to see him. I'm just ready to be inspired. I want to hear your story. I want to hear your pain. I want to hear your version of events. You know what I'm saying? So, so yeah, I can't wait. So graft, let's hear what you got to say, bro. Any hatred in yourself, then you want to be him or you want to be her. The media promotes all the hate and tells us all the things to prefer. Like, like all the white skin, light skin is okay. Don't like the dark skin, they're rude with an attitude. They try hold us down to stop the magnitude. Be black, be proud, rise up with gratitude. It was deep, man. It hit me deep. Imagine if it were you, tell me what would you do? Do you think you could cope and keep your moral up and not lose hope? And now your friends don't pick up your calls and you can feel them building up walls. Even though they know you're sleeping on the floor, they feel they've done enough and can't help you no more. That was an amazing concept. Oh, there's no reality on TV. The facts don't match the CV. There's hidden truths, believe me. This generation's caught up in a fantasy. You're caught up in a social facade of who you've got to be. And who you really want to be, but only you can set that free and mediate a social need. It wasn't as strong as it usually is in terms of the delivery. I felt like it was a lot of head down, a little, it was more mumblish. Got my mosh up like Skeng doing the A and flying the jetpack. Look, UK went into lockdown, so I can't shut down, gotta get my head right. Right? Look, but by now you already know this. I was meant to rap about social issues. I was gonna rap about COVID and now we're fucked up. Everything for everyone, but we already know this. I even talk about it about laughing because it was, it was he was just a vibe. He was just a vibe. Everything about him was just a vibe. Like I'll like, I'll go see him perform. We talk, but they don't wanna hear. Then they tell us, let our hair down. So I'll speak my truth till I'm dead, man. It is what it is, and I said what I said, so fuck it. It's time for crabs to tip the bucket. Supreme suppression, yeah, they love it, stuff it. Time for us to rise above it. We got a voice, so discuss it. Cause I don't like how you portray my people. How can we be the ones that's evil? You've enslaved our ancestors for years, and all now we just wanna be equal. D Life didn't hold any of his punches and was just really straight up about what he wanted to say and, and unapologetic about it, and very relevant, very relatable. 
and I, I got to rate that. No slacking at all. This is going to be a difficult, difficult vote, man.